Miss Delago? You're late. You're... Henry? Vienna. What, 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 what are, are you, you doing, doing here? here? Henry, what are you doing here in this ludicrous disguise? It is ludicrous, but it's no disguise. Oh, Henry. I am a, a limousine driver. Oh, she's sweet as a lay. Say like air. And you, you do look kind of cute in that cap. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, well, you, uh, you look, you look ravishing, chic, no, sneaky. Excuse me? Yes, um, let me just ask you a question here. It just dawned on me. Uh, what are you doing here in the middle of the night at the mall with these uh, Jackie O sunglasses and uh, this disguise who would, that would fool no one? Uh, I am making a discreet exit. Uh, what, a discreet? This is discreet for you? I'd hate to see Showy. <laughs> you know, Henry, I normally don't really discuss my personal life with the chauffeur, so please, let's just proceed to the airport in silence. Uh, hey, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, I think I've got it now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my God, yeah. Could it be, could it be? Let's see, pack no, the bags, at the, little, little, pack like the bags at the hotel, mouse. and then I pick you up here. Yeah, have um, a plane to catch. I understand that, but you are, are you, are you are, you are not making a discreet exit, are you? Henry, you're, you're running. Move it. No, I don't think so. I don't think so. I think I just got a very profitable fare. I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh, what I'm talking about is a very substantial gratuity for my, uh, what did you call it? My, my discretion. Well, you know what? There is another word. Blackmail. Oh, a rose by any other names. Why would I pay you anything when you know nothing? I, um, what I know is that you're all dolled up and you're using a false name and you're trying to escape out of here under the cover of night. And what does that tell me? That tells me that Simon Fraser is going to be on that tarmac what? when that airplane lands. Oh, gosh, I can't believe it. What is he, what is he, tired of Carly already? Or, or was this the plan from the get-go? There was no plan. Please, come on, come on, come on, come on. Simon knows that Jack still loves Carly enough to make sure that they both get away safely. What, he's supposed <laughs> to contact you after he dumps her? What? You know what? You should be a writer, not a driver, with such an imagination. Mm -hmm. You're not, you're not meeting Simon. No! Okay. Okay. All right, then. I'll just call Jack and give him the heads no. up. No! Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. So I was right. No! It's not that. Put the phone uh, down. Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna call him so he can say bon voyage. No! I am not running to Simon Fraser. I am running from the U.S. government. The feds? Yes. Doll is trying to have me extradited. For revenge! Feds. Wow. You know, the bad thing about the feds, they have, they have way too many guns and no sense of humor. And they're trying to send me back to Leonia and yeah. freeze my assets. Ooh. You know what? Now, mm -hmm. now I'm really happy because I have you as my chauffeur. Yeah. My dear, smart Henry to help me escape from this terrible injustice, this abuse of power. This, 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 this is where I say adios. No. Henry, no, don't, don't, don't treat me this way. Well, you won't survive, won't stay alive. Oh. oh, great, great. I'm gonna have that in my head for the next week. If you leave me now. Uh, you know what? Song lyrics are not gonna change my mind. You but, have a grip like a vice. Oh, don't you see? You, you know, your you fate meant for you to help me. Uh -huh. You know, we were brought together there was something bigger than what we are. I'm losing the sensation in my hand. Henry, do the right thing and help me escape. Okay, I know this my, mm, I know this matters to you, not at all, but what about me, Vienna? You? Yes, me, me. What happens to me when the feds arrest me okay. for helping you escape? You are just a chauffeur uh, doing his job. I, I know, I wish that made a difference, but you see, I just wiggled my way out of charges for aiding and abetting a fugitive, and that's how I became a chauffeur in the first place, and would you please let go of my arm? No, not until you say you will help me. I'll help you. I don't believe you. <sighs> I, you know, I, I, after 20 more seconds, I'm not going to be able to drive. Fine. Huh. So, shall we talk about that gratuity? I'm so weak. Well, all you need is an incentive to do the right thing. And at this point, it has to be money because there's no time for anything personal. Well, money's fine. No, no, no. No. Money, am I no, money is not fine. What good is money if it ends up sending me up the river? Okay, I wonder, what do you say about $200? Uh, what, is that a joke? How about 2000 lady? $2,000? That's absurd! What would I ever pay you $2,000? Uh, I think you just got your answer. Come on.